So this is Centraca Day. I'm gonna put this up for you guys. Yes, I took pictures the first time and put put them on my field guide. Oh, good. I'll just take a quick video and then you guys can always stop it if you want. Kind of a still, my really poor video. Alright. On to the next. Here we have family. We're on a day. White bass and striped bass. You see the the lines aren't quite continuous on the white bass, but they are on the striped. Family salmon day. The differences here are the spots. Sorry. So brown trout, dark spots, light background, rainbow, tiny dark spots, and there's spots on the caudal fin. Eastern brook trout, light spots. A little bit on the caudal fin. No spots on the caudal fin of the brown trout. Alright guys, tell us the difference between these. How do you tell them apart? What is this family? Ictelluridae. Ictelluridae, good. Um, so, the snail bullhead, he doesn't have a forked tail. It's <coughs> black tail. The channel catfish had a forked tail. Do you, both of these guys have subterminal mouths. And the flathead has a terminal mouth mm -hmm. right in front. Super flat. And his head is like a tube. Yeah. yeah, really square. Super flat. He has that nice modeling, modeling, right? Yep. Very nice. Thanks, guys. Yeah, Legs tight, hold on tight to the ceiling and slag mites try with all their might to touch the ceiling. So this is the <laughs> Catastomidae family. What were you just saying there, Lydia? How'd you tell them about it? Does that have something to do with this? Mm -hmm. No, concave is like a cave. Oh, and gotcha. That's saying you know how to tell the difference between a slug. <laughs> so which one of these has concave um, between their eyes? Hog sucker. Very good. And then what is it for the striped jump rock? On this. Yep. Anything else you're really using to tell them apart? No. Is that the biggest? Does this one always have a more downturned mouth? She said it was, said it was smushed. Oh, it was yeah, smushed. Okay. Yeah. Uh, that is, uh, the between the eyes is the biggest. I think you thing, can just right? narrow down yeah. the suckers and then tell. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh, Thanks, guys. Uh, Seriously? Is I don't know what I wrote down. Uh, gold Sounds Shiner is upturned. Yellow Fin Shiner is terminal. Blue Head is subterminal. This yeah. is family. Suprena Day. Go. There it is. Suprena Day. Very good. The one's down. All right, tell me these apart. What have you got in your hand there, Danny? Yeah. Put me on the spot here. I think this is bluehead chub, and this is yellowfin shiner. Boston How do you tell those two apart? One has a terminal mouth, and one has a downward. Bluehead has subterminal. Yeah. You see how this it's is down right here, where it's pointed. Right. Down below this one. The kind of point of the head, yeah. right? Yeah. This one's regular. And that one's Straight the yellow shiner. That's yellow yeah. fin. It has like a triangle shape kind of terminal head. Yeah. It's got that yeah. line. Just the terminal outward facing, or is that is that upwards facing? Terminal is just straight out. Yeah, straight but is out. that this, is that considered upwards or is that is considered straight out? Straight the golden out. has okay. upturned. The okay. golden has upturned. Let's That's right. look at that. Oh yeah. It's snooty. Right. He's he's frowning. He's not too happy. Yeah. Okay, yellowfin shiner. Here, Just think of fish. chubs and they're sad. Anything else proud. to tell these three apart? The let's see the um the fin on the yellowfin shiner. The edges. 
They're usually kind of yellowish, right? Can you yeah. does help you tell it apart? It's hard without actual coloration, huh? But they are yeah, pretty so yellowy. Silly. Um, and then what about the carp there? Marbles. Marbles. But then Marbles. how do you know it's not a catfish? Scales. scales. Good. So very large scales. Those scales are really easy to see. Do catfish have scales? No. Mm -hmm. no. Thank you. What do they have? Skin. Skin <laughs> like, I don't know. <laughs> Alright, thank you. Bye-bye.